So, I have some fabulous, well, I think they're fabulous, learning resources that I want to share with you today for Pandas. Now, Pandas is a, it's a fantastic Python package for working with data. It's definitely made, I think it's one of the Python packages that have made Python so popular amongst data analysts and data scientists. You know, if it weren't for Pandas, I don't think Python would be so popular in those fields. Um, it was written by Wes McKinney over a decade ago now, and it's just a great package for working with data. And, you know, if you're new to Python, new to Pandas, and you haven't yet tried it, uh, I think once you know how to use it just even a little bit, you'll probably want to move away from Excel. If you already know a little bit about Pandas, then you know, you're beginning to see just how powerful and useful it is. And maybe you want to learn a little bit more. So whichever group you're in, hopefully there'll be some learning resources in this video that will help you. But before we move on to those, I just want to tell you a little bit about my Discord server. It's called Code School, and it's a community of people that want to learn to code, that want to improve their coding. Um, we have mentors, mentors that work in software engineering, that work in data science, that work in academia. And it's just a place that, uh, that you can visit um, where you'll get advice and support you know, on your coding, your learning to code journey, uh, which can sometimes be a bit lonely, but it needn't be with this Discord server. So there's a link in the description. Go and take a look. I think you'll really like it. So the learning resources then. Okay, well, the first one, it actually comes with a little bit of advice. Now, this is something you may or may not know, but I'm going to tell you anyway, because it's something I didn't know. And I think it's something that a lot of beginners don't know. One of the best places to learn whatever it is you want to learn is the documentation. Read the documentation. Now, the documentation can often be off-putting for newcomers, for beginners, because there's so much of it and it seems overly technical. But often somewhere amongst all that documentation, there will be a summary, you know, a starting place that's like an introduction to whatever it is that you're trying to learn. So, you know, look for that and try to find that. But you will learn so much from the documentation, whether it's NumPy, you know, or some other Python package that you're learning, Scikit-learn or something like that, or whether it's the language itself, the, the documentation for Python is really good. And it's the same with Pandas. Pandas has really good documentation um, and Pandas also has what's it called the 10 minutes to Pandas guide. So that's what I'm going to recommend that you do first. Read through the 10 minutes to Pandas. This is what it looks like. There's a link in the, in the description. Also, all of these resources will be in my Discord server as well. So everything that I recommend on this channel will go in the Discord server. So that's another good reason to go and visit. Just go to the Discord server. You're going to love it. All right. So this is the 10 minute, uh, 10 minutes to pandas. Start there. When you've worked through that and you've had, you know, you've done some playing around, you know, install pandas, get some data, download some data and start applying these techniques on the 10 minutes to pandas on the data that you've downloaded. Do that. And then what I'd like to recommend is this. Well, I've got a couple of Git, uh, GitHub repos. So this is the first one that I'm recommending. Um, this is Pandas Exercises. And here you have a load of Pandas Exercises that you can work through, um, which I think will really help you to practice some elements of using pandas. So move on to that next. And then the next uh, GitHub that I want to recommend is this one. This is by Stephanie Molin. Um, this is a pandas workshop by Stephanie, uh, and it's definitely worth taking a look at. Now, Stephanie's book, this is the second edition. I've read the first edition. I haven't read the second edition, but her hands-on data analysis with pandas is really a very good book on pandas. Once you've worked through these exercises, uh, then I would suggest if you want to buy a book and you don't need to buy anything to learn pandas, you can learn it for free. But if you were thinking of buying something and you were looking for a book, I'd recommend this book. The link to the book is in the description. On Amazon, it only gets a three star rating, but I think that it doesn't really reflect how good the book is. It's a great book that works on real data sets that um, takes a look at some of the trickier aspects of pandas. So it would definitely be worth your while having a look at that. Those are the resources. Work through them methodically. By the time you get to the end, you will be pretty proficient with pandas. Good luck. 
and join the Discord server. You'll really like it.